I love my friend Blue Jay. We're both above language. I like music and mouth. Bat bat. Bat 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 bat. <laughs> and that's really where the red line came from. It came from Guido of Asario, another G timer. Bat 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 bat. <laughs> And that's where the light of death came from. It was because that's music. He took music above language. Because before they had to send the, and he was another preacher that they had to send him around with all of the other. <laughs> By Blue Jay, I'm ignoring him. Guido of Assyria. He's the one who brought music above language, like, like math. Okay. Well, G timers bring humanity above language. Okay, and we can do that just by thinking with science. E, energy, matter, put them together. E equals MC squared. That's the literacy object. All humans on Earth and all critters can point at the literacy object, you know, at objects from the literacy object. Okay, and so these all have energy and matter. But what's an American? Point at one. <laughs> What's a democracy? Point at it. Where's Middle East on a basketball? Point at it. You can't. And that's where our, you know, our logic gets overridden. Let me give it to you another way. That's up. That's down. No. We're on the side of the earth. We don't get this given to us. And we have to put humanity in motion instead of being word slaves. Okay, to concepts that are private definitions. Blue Jay still wants to play. This is the most important part right here, all right? Zero, one, two, three, four. The zero quantity. That's mathematics takes us up above language because with zero in our processing, we have a base state. It's so negative and positive and negative and positive. You Humanity goes into motion. Whereas the way we're taught, one, two, three, four, five, there's no other way. You're stuck and you are a word slave of whatever language you're born into. Okay, and our logic gets overridden. Where our native object logic, the kid's logic, the logic we're born for, is just objects of energy and matter. Earth objects, or, you know, human objects, you know, living objects, all of those things. You don't need to, you just point and it's there. It's like the logic, like you came, let's go back 30,000 years. You came running up to me, rubbing your belly. I point over at my cave and your arms fly up and we hug all the way there. We eat and then we cave paint. And so, we're just, language is notation, advanced cave painting. But we are, we are word slaved as trusting children to be controlled. Whereas then we don't have a sustainable state of mind, the native object logic mind, the G-timers mind that grows towards that. My friend, we will never ever be right. But with two classes of time, we identify the physical objects that are the same, no matter the language. And we identify the language concepts that don't have any energy or matter, that are different in all the languages, and they're different in all the humans. Because, you know, I, I'm Christian, I'm Muslim. You can't point at it. It's private definition. And every generation of private definition or people suffering the coronavirus have gotten more dangerous in one class of time. That is brainwashing. Our native object logic, our null, our most basic, you know, thoughts. The way we're, you know, that where we own our feelings first. 
instead of being owned by language, you're the critic in our head. Oh my gosh, don't listen to them. You gotta trust your eyes and the logic, your earth objects, life objects. Be connected to those. And the concept objects that have no energy or matter, they're dividing you from your own body and your own thought and your own logic and the logic the children. And like when we were, you know, when you came running up to me with your belly, that logic is in every one of us and we are gonna take humanity above language, like music and math. Math is the same everywhere, it's a natural law. I mean, one plus one equals two on Mars. Okay, and so that has always been, I, we all can point to one object, another object, those objects. That is mathematical reasoning. That is our base reasoning. You gotta be able to point at the object. Whereas the language right now is overriding our sensory perception of the world. And so G timers, simple with two classes of time. No matter the language, we end up evolving back to our base state, the sustainable brain that got us here, the sustainable brain and blossom, you know, that is a moving life CPU, I can tell you scientifically, I've done it, I know I do a lot of, you know, improv and funny things and, you know, and make you go, oh, there's something wrong with him. But listen, I've said the same thing since 2008 when I joined YouTube. I saw a video, an old 2000 and seven or eight video I know just the other day and it's like I'm saying the same thing in a million different ways think with physical objects identify concepts energy matter put them together you have the literacy object and that gave birth to the concept object okay it's like where's Middle East on a basketball it's a concept from our species that is language driven that carries see that the Igrunta virus is actually, you know, it gets more dangerous every generation, but it's the reason that it is getting more dangerous, there's more private definition, more, you know, these people flying planes into buildings for words that, can, that, are, that you can't even point at. And so they talk themselves into anything. And that to us, it will never be right, but we gotta do right, okay? And that means spreading the word, the simple classic of time will fix us, even without all the tools that I've made up. I mean, that I've invented, or system design. And so I love you, friends. Sign on and help me at this particular infant period. I'm treating all of um, um, uh, September as the infant time for me to get my feet under me and, and that we get G-Timers ready for the mass market. And, you know, it's like, oh, some guy from nature is wanting to class time. Once the national media hears that, it's all, you know, it's just going to be a tidal wave. But right now, we gotta get our get it together. And that's why I'm wanting, you know, the root you root G timers are the ones that are that are really gonna set us off. And so I love you friends. Sign on. All like I said, I've changed it. If you give a hundred bucks, I'll do a video signing of your certificate. Okay? And I'll put the date on it myself, the time, and I'll write your name out. It'll be beautiful. It'll be fun. These are the infant time of the, of the G-Timers. And this is, I mean, the whole of crime, I mean, all of recorded history is a crime scene against two classes of time. But we got the tools to accelerate our, our, and to preserve the native object logic, you know, in the children, and you must know, or you wouldn't be watching these videos, that we're on to something here. And we could grow again. Remember, zero, one, two, three, four. So now we have a base point. Negative, positive, negative, positive. You know, that one. And so we could just start, you can see, we'll keep going positive, positive, positive. Might bounce backwards a little bit. But you process the world in an adaptable way because you think with objects of energy and matter. This is science. This is the physics of inheritance. Okay? Apply the physics of inheritance. We cannot be what we made up on your language. If that identifies the concepts you can't point to. So I love you. Bring back that 30,000 year old go logic in you with technology. And my gosh, we're above language. Like music and math, and you will know that together we can do it for all of humanity from the simple classic of time, 380 years later.
I love you, friends. Bye bye. Sign on. Sign on. Sign on. I'm a tuna, I'm a cougar, it's the same in your mind.